Hey everybody, it's Alma. Welcome back to Keto Meets Menopause. Hey, hey, hey. All right, guys, gonna do a mini haul. Let's see what time it is. Oh, what happened? My watch didn't want to work this morning. Oh well. So I have my other one on. It says that I'm at 14,000 steps. There's no way because I did seven miles. No way. All right, guys, I picked up a couple things. Now, I shared with you guys that Matthew is kind of doing low carb, he's not doing keto. And so I picked up a few things that Matthew likes all right so this would be low carb or I'm sure be fine with this this does have sugars in it I picked up this for me and David which is I'm on a coleslaw kit guys interestingly enough we found out that has a lot of the same vitamins and nutrients as liver does guys as chicken liver specifically how funny is that I've just traded one for the other uh, some more of this southwest chopped kit these are just easy, guys. I wish it didn't have the carrots. Gosh, I wish it didn't. Everything else in here is perfect. Um, now, granted, not the dressing and stuff, but I don't usually use that. And then some more gizzards. I am in the mood for some fried gizzards. I got some cherries. Interestingly enough, guys, everybody seems to go in the world of keto in the direction of berries. Did you know that cherries are like the lowest glycemic index fruit? They are. Interesting. I picked up some butter for Matt and um, some taco seasoning actually some taco meat with seasoning already in there for Matthew um, I figured this is actually better than those little packets uh, that have maltodextrin in them so I figured this would be better uh, of course doing it the way I do it it would be best so I should just mix him up a jar of the seasoning and have him uh, use that in fact that's a good plan Alma I'm gonna do that and then I picked this up I might actually use some of this guys not gonna be perfectly keto because you know this is always gonna have sugar on it this is where we ketoers really have to do our work yeah it says zero, zero carbs but you know they're in the ingredients there's sugar you know it's not the first ingredient but there you go it's sugar but you know what I figured it'd be worth a try for something different. We will see. We will see. Hey, everybody. It's Alma. Welcome back to my channel. Quick haul, guys. All right. Let me show you what I found. I had to go get some things for my mom, so I thought I would go ahead and do a quick haul for a few things because they were on sale. So check out these cold brew coffees. These are originally $6.99. They're all organic. $6.99 each on sale. Two for $6. I got two of the Colombian one of the Sumatran and one of the Guatemalan. All cold brew, we'll see how these go. These were on sale, uh, these are two for six dollars. Guys, I should have been very clear. I am buying this because I really enjoy the mixture. Not the, not necessarily the carrots in here, uh, but I do enjoy the overall mixture. And if life wasn't so hectic, guys, I would be doing this myself, chopping it up. But I don't have the time right now, just being flat out honest. So this is my lazy keto. I'm not necessarily using the dressing, guys, or the uh, included chips. I might actually give those to my sister who is on a salad kick right now. Um, and we'll see. I actually am taking one of these to her. And I've got these for my mom. These are the Ocean Spray Diet 5 calories guys per serving would you drink this let me know i remember keto connect at one point in time did a video and i think they were using this for their uh vodka so let me know if you would even dare into drinking this as i shared with you guys matthew is doing kind of low carb and he wanted a treat the other day and there was nothing in the house other than my chocolate and so I picked up some of these for him to see if maybe he would enjoy them. These are three three for five dollars. All right, then I got these for my mom, guys. Nope, not keto. Sorry, wish they were. These here were on sale, guys. The uh, lean versions were um, not on sale. They were still eight ninety nine or nine ninety nine a pound. This was on sale five dollars. Angus. This is grass fed Angus ground beef, eighty five percent lean, fifteen percent fat. Got two of those, again, $5 each. And then I got plans for this on a recipe. And finally, guys, these oven baked cheese. Uh, this is supposed to be like bread cheese. So I am gonna give it a try, see what it tastes like. $7.99 a piece, guys. This is strictly for y'all. I love y'all so much. I spent $7.99 on this. Can you believe it? Oh my gosh, it pained me. It 
pained me, guys. I said the other day I was over my liver and I thought oh, over the weekend I might like some liver and eggs. Such a good breakfast, guys, so I went ahead and picked up one. All right, and look at that. If you're on a budget, guys, $1.91 for some protein, heck yeah. All right, and then this, $6.99, this would feed us at least three meals. Okay, everybody, Alma sent me to the store and this is what I had to get. Of course, each item required four or five phone calls to make sure that I was getting the right thing, but she wanted romaine hearts. And the way she described them was a little lettuce boat. So after four or five little old ladies that I asked, she one of them finally pointed me in the right direction. And then she wanted some poblano peppers, which I found, found some nice little poblano peppers in a in plastic bags. She wanted three, but I got four because they came in pairs. And you had to call me and ask if that was I had okay. to ask if, if that was okay because she's very frightening. <laughs> and then she wanted some queso fresco. Of course, I went to the place where it was just a bucket of what I thought was queso, and she said, oh no, no, no. She wanted the crumbly kind of cheese. So and as you I can didn't see, even tell you that this is this is not what I wanted. It's a little round disc, but it's okay. This is not what you wanted? No, but thank you. Well, you made me stop calling you. <laughs> Gosh. But this is work. This will work. This is quick keto. I'm glad you like thank it. Thank you. So I'm much. glad you like it. Yeah. I am so fortunate. glad. That's why we try and then she, it. Thank you, baby. This is my video. <laughs> and this is pico de gallo. I asked her if she wanted mild, hot, or medium. She said she wanted hot. I wanted mild, so we wound up with medium. <laughs> Took it on the average. I was wondering if she wanted it with mango. Oh, yes, I would have loved that. Not very keto. Yeah. And of course, I got some half and half for my coffee. Instead of the heavy whipping cream. Not Instead sure. of the heavy wh whipping cream. Yeah. Half but, and half. That's okay. You like it that. is. I like half and half. I like a little snort of half and half in my coffee. And of course, when it's half full, then it becomes quarter and quarter. <laughs> and my favorite. My favorite Keurig coffee, Chevalier Columbia. And I put a little Himalayan sea salt in it, and then a little stevia, sweet leaf caramel flavor, and some coconut oil and butter, and I go to town with it. That's my grocery haul, and it is my first grocery haul. Good job. Thank you very much. It's not the first time you've gone to the grocery store. It's not the first time I've gone to the grocery store, but it is, them. It I do. But this is the first time she ever wanted me to put it on camera. Good job, baby. Okay, guys. <laughs> Bye. All right, so you saw that I purchased this organic cold brew coffee from Randall's, two for six dollars. I thought the last day of this sale will be tomorrow, so I better see if I like it. If I do, I'll go pick up a few more. Maybe the organic, I'll have less issues with hot flashes. We'll see. So I never do cold coffee, guys. Even the cold brew, I usually warm up in my microwave. So we're just gonna try this out today. I'm kind of wanting some coffee. So here we go. I have got my ice in my giant insulated cup. My favorite cup, guys. My insulated cup. All right, so. I'm going to go ahead and use some half and half, some cold brew coffee, and a Sweet Drops Caramel. This is David's favorite. Favorite, favorite. This is made by Sweet Leaf and only has stevia in it. All right, let's go ahead and check this out. All right, guys, we're going to go with four squirts. That's what David does. All right, we're going to pour our coffee. I wish this was heavy whipping cream, but it's not. Alright, added some half and half, probably two tablespoons. Grab a straw. Get it all mixed up. Let's give it a try. Not bad, guys. Not bad at all. Alright, let's get our morning started again. Thank you so much for allowing me to spend time with you. If you haven't already done so, please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification button so that you'll know each time I post a new video. All right, guys, have a great day. Bye-bye. Choice Wednesday, it's Onito. Now here's my wife to teach us keto. Pork rinds, pork rinds, rah, rah, rah. Carbohydrates, carbohydrates, blah, blah, blah. Thank <laughs> you.